Hey folks, this is, this is Mark Smith. I'm coming at you live from the hometown, that being rotten of the Massachusetts variety. Oh, let me tell you, I am Mark C. Smith, and my hometown has just lost a very valued treasure. A very old structure, such as this one, although it was built 333 years ago, if you can believe that. It sort of makes the difference, the 25, 30 year difference between the 1980 something years and the present seem like a tiny little sliver, such as the length of human life itself in the greater scheme of things. How long do we live? Not very. Life is very short. Eventually age just catches up with us. As him, I remember that guy there when he was a young skinny man with a brown mustache and uh, a full head of hair. But I guess time just changes people. Yeah. I moved on. For better or for worse. I wonder how Dad's taken all these nice, delicate comments I'm making on him. Well, time is nice because time lets you see things. Time lets you grow. Yeah. There's the other side of time, but hey, we won't talk about that. Yeah, time is like a clock in the heart, I guess. Yeah. It just goes wham. Yeah. Well. Time is like uh, poignant as it gets as it moves along. Poignant, poignant. You see, it's bitter, but it's happy. But we're gonna take you down Broad Meadow Road, a much more relevant and important, vital piece of the history for my mother, my sister, and I. There's something down here, and that sign, that orange sign to my right, just below the 25 mile an hour speed limit sign, denotes something that my sister and I were one of back when we went down here a lot. What does that sign say? It says children. Yeah. Since if you could back, move time back in time lapse photography, Going back to 1980-something. Five or something. Like 87 or something. <laughs> well, we were all kids at some point, but this, not to be a big time Michael Jackson or Peter Pan, but hey, you know, there's a certain element of childhood that never really leaves any of us. What do you think? We're yeah, gonna... You always have it, your roots, your heart is right there. Uh, and that's what you are. And yeah. So, uh, these uh, always remember that these snooty towns ain't got nothing on where I grew up. Well, <laughs> yeah, but there's always good parts of every town. Uh, this is a nice town. That's where I settled. Yeah. Aye, aye, aye. So there's a very important wall. I mean, it's got the scare. I'm trying to think. It's got the T right down to a scale, this wall coming up. My mother would know or understand that joke. Mom would get the joke. This wall right here, it's T to the scale. I mean, it's, we're talking, it's got, it's got the T right down to the scale. It's got the scale right down to the T. I wonder what Mom or Erica would think. If Mom didn't get it instantly, Erica would probably be the one to alert her to it, but... Dad, this is the T to the scale wall. It's really got the T down to the scale and the scale down to the T. Hey, Mom, you remember this wall? I've got it teed right down to the scale. And I've got it scaled right down to the T. This is the wall as it stands roughly some 25 years after what mom might recall. 
So we probably changed a little. It's hard to say whether or not that basketball court was there. Dad, was that court there? Oh, I don't know. It's been a long time since I've been down here. Well, I've been awful young back when we used to live here. So then here's the second part of the wall. Is this the back of the wall? Yes, it is. And I'm not really sure how old that building is. Although it says the Groton Library was established in 1854, I'm not sure how many times they rebuilt the building. They just figured they got to build all the buildings they can build, I guess. Ah, yeah, yeah. Mom would get that joke too. I got the T all. I got this wall teed right down to a scale. It's just scaled right down to a T. Just chill, man. Just chill. It's the wall I'm filming, actually. Teed right down to a scale and scale right down to a T. This is a wall of which my mom would probably be able to understand. Someday I hope Erica will show mom this and she'll, uh, mom will get the tea to the scale jokes. Scale right down to a T. It's a little house, but it, or it's a little house, but it's not on the prairie. Oh yeah, maybe it's a part of the park. It could be a part of the park thing, but then you gotta put it in reverse or you gotta put it in drive. Yeah, let me see what does it show in front. Maybe in front it probably shows the opposite side of the back. Maybe the Groton Park thing. Mom will probably also appreciate that. Oh, no, it looks like it's a garage. Oops. It's probably a garage for the house up here in front. Anyways, this is video number three. And the max out in length is gonna happen in just over four minutes, where the video just stops. Like it's counting down right now. It's going four minutes, 15 seconds, and it's just going down. And there's nothing you can do that's gonna make the video last any longer. If you want more video time, you just gotta stop it or let it run out and start the next video. So, how would you picture this being different than, say, Harvard Yard, or the more like Cambridge and stuff? Groton, how's Groton a little different than that? Well, it's more obvious spread out, because in Harvard, everything's squeezed together, so the land is valuable. It doesn't here, but I, that's why I always like the country if it's spread out more. Or like Melrose Place, that's another city town, I think. It's like, it's all... I don't know much of Melrose, isn't that really? It's not like this place, it's more the opposite, it's like... Yeah, it's like a close-up suburb of the city. It's more built up. Like Somerville? Yeah. Oh, more built up than Somerville, though. Well, I don't know. I'm not familiar. I don't care about classes. I'm by no means a snobby person at all. I mean, I'm not sure. I guess, like, that's my idea. And I'm no, by no means a reverse prejudice snobby person either. No, I grew up in Len. And Len was fine. I mean, the place you are who you are. And, uh, right, Kasha was not lying. We are who we are. And, and I think the good people love you, bro. Although I really don't know about the whole crack open the nightclub thing. That was kind of... She is an awful lot of humor. Oh, anyway, that's irrelevant to the topic of this video. <laughs> I'm talking about the er lyrics at the earlier part of the song Glow by Kasha. That's, uh, yeah, well, I don't know about that either. The lyrics, I try to just play dumb and imagine or pretend I don't know what they mean, but until the person whispers in my ear what the lyrics mean, and I'm like, 
and my face turns red. How do we get into this topic? All right, let's keep going. I'm gonna show Dad the part of Groton. I wasn't in a hurry, but they kind of needed to turn quick. That's Broad Meadow Road. That's very Keystone. So, yeah, never once would I ever pan the camera this way. I don't know why. I just wouldn't. They should just build it board for board. I mean, looks like that restaurant looks okay from the outside, doesn't it? Maybe they yeah. can rescue all the furniture. I don't think they're going to restore that the way it is. I think they're going to end up uh, just probably putting something in there, maybe a plaza or something. What do you think? Maybe they could at least rescue the furniture from the restaurant or whatnot if it, uh, if it I, was... I, probably yeah. not. I doubt it. So probably what, what it is is by now, with all the growth that's happened here, it's probably all fairly well-to-do people who live in here. And they're probably going to put, this is the only strip mall they have. The only shopping they have, I bet they're going to put something in there. Okay, whatever. I'll be in denial. By the way, this video has only 35 seconds. Then we have to start the next video. You want to go? Wanna I want to show you the part of uh, the Groton Town Center I like the most. And hope that the viewfinder or live view can stay on through the whole duration. Then eventually we'll have to leave because the weather looks like it's... And I may show you the house I almost bought. Okay. Up, oh, it's 10 seconds and then the video stops. So I'm going to put the brakes on my walking right now to let the thing go to one.